Welcome to the Telebs Optical and Soft Switch series video, Initial Setup. The purpose of this video is to introduce the soft switch functionality that enables analog phone services on the Telebs Optical and system and provide instruction on the initial setup in Panorama. Other videos in this series will outline more detailed procedures related to soft switch voice function on the Optical and system. The topics covered in this video will be an overview of analog voice services over the optical LAN system, and instructions on the initial configuration of the tconfig application. SoftSwitch is a central device in a telecommunications network which connects telephone calls from one phone line to another across an enterprise network, entirely by means of software running on a general purpose system. Typically, voice over IP phones are used in this system. VoIP phones use a protocol called Session Initiated Protocol for initiating, maintaining, and terminating real-time voice sessions. Analog phones can be supported on the Ethernet network by deploying optical LAN ONTs with integrated SIP agents. The SIP agent converts the POTS interface from an analog phone to the Ethernet network using Session Initiated Protocol. The SIP agent is configured using a dedicated function of the Panorama EMS called tconfig. tconfig provides instructions to the ONT SIP agent to interface with the soft switch in the same way that a VoIP phone would. To support analog phones on the Telebs Optical LAN system, the tconfig application needs to be enabled. This can easily be done during the software installation or upgrade process. There is a process to do this once software is installed. Consult documentation for that procedure. When the software installation process is started, select the Panorama Pawn server installation. Select the custom installation. Then select Enable Integrated tconfig. When prompted, this will enable the tconfig application in the Panorama GUI. Once the tconfig app has been enabled, the software installation process will request an IP address for management and tconfig IP address. For the security of the network, it is best to create a separate NIC for tconfig operation. Once the EMS software is updated, a voice VLAN will need to be established. The system can be configured with a separate voice VLAN or with voice and management sharing the same VLAN. For security reasons in a production environment, it is best to configure the voice into a separate VLAN to isolate your voice resources from all external access to prevent any attacks on the voice subsystem and to minimize the ability of people to snoop the contents of the voice VLAN. The voice VLAN must be placed into the VLAN properties for each OLT so that the system knows that this VLAN exists. This is done in the switching application under the VLAN properties table. Once entered, the VLAN should be mapped onto one or more uplink interfaces. In this example, the voice VLAN 2995 has been mapped onto the Net1 uplink interface. Each NE supports a separate tconfig server address so that each NE can point to the appropriate NIC. To set this IP, right-click on the OLT and select Properties. Click the Voice over IP tab and enter the appropriate IP address. This is the IP address that was set up for tconfig during the software installation. This port should never be changed. The tconfig configuration application is launched by selecting the tconfig icon. Here, profiles are created to be applied to SIP agent ONTs and phone lines. These profiles will be covered in the next video in the Soft Switch Voice video series. In this video, we have discussed an overview of analog voice services over the optical LAN system and instructions on the initial configuration of the tconfig application.